Water. Water? Water. Whistle. Any ways. What's oh, up, guys? <laughs> Did you say what with an H? What are what? you talking about? Anyway. I don't know. I'm going to be playing Wizard of Legend. <laughs> no, but seriously, I'm going to be playing Wizard of Legend, as you can see here on the screen. Press any button. There you go. I pressed a button. It was the X button. Uh, it came out apparently on almost everything. But I'm playing it on PlayStation 4, as per usual. Lil Mama's here, because we were talking, and uh, I felt like streaming. So, say hi, Lil Mama. Hi. She's not going to be joining me. You said it. Yeah, she's not going to be joining me uh, in the actual gameplay. But uh, she will no. be joining to uh, help fill dead air, if there is any. We shall see. Anyway, if you haven't heard of Wizard of Legend, it came out on the 15th of this month, which is May? Yes. Sure, why not? Uh, um, it is a top-down roguelite, I hesitate to say shooter, because you're not using guns or anything ish, whatever, you'll see. But one way that I've heard it described is enter the gungeon or Binding of Isaac, but with magic. So, that's a thing. Anyway, I played like maybe five minutes of the opening level, and I thought it was really awesome. Good music, good atmosphere, the tutorial area is interesting. Let me just say that, but anyway, uh, let's go ahead and just jump in here. Probably gonna have, you know what, let's, let's go for an hour for the first episode. It'll be fun. Um, so, press X to continue. Here we are at the Lenovo Museum. Hello, bird. Goodbye, bird. So, let's uh, just talk to everybody and see what happens. Hello, Alex. I love to come by to Hi, relax Alex. and feed the birds. Alex is an NPC in the game. It's just... Fucking birds. Wow. Put your eyes out. It says, if you're looking for the Museum of Lenova, it's just up ahead. No way. The big staircase didn't clue me in at all. As you can see, it's uh, pixel art based. So if that's either going to be your thing or it's not going to be your thing. You either like pixel art or you don't. I like it. So check out this fucking guy darting around like he's high on methamphetamines. Anyway, let's just talk to everybody. <laughs> Matt says, I'm supposed to meet my friend for the Chaos Trials exhibit. But she's running a bit late. I'm sorry, bro. You got ditched. All right, let's talk to the information desk. Anna, welcome to the Museum of Lenova. Here's a complimentary Airburst Dash Arcana for your convenience. Well, thanks, Anna. So as you can see, we're, we're, we can do the same thing this guy's doing now. Ta-da, ta-da, ta-da. Darting all around is cool stuff. Okay. All right, Spike. Did you know that true wizards never take their hoods off? Maya. Never, ever, 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 never. It's true. True wizards never take their hoods off. They're actually glued to the top of our heads. It's horrible. Jacob, we love coming to the museum. All the exhibits are so fun and interactive. Melissa, we always get so excited about this place, and yet you're sitting in the corner of the entrance. Not even looking at exhibits. My word, did I miss anything here? Info, this way to the Chaos Trials exhibit. Don't mind if I do. So this is just talking about like some of the different magics and whatnot. Info, on display are some of the arcana that wizards used in the Chaos Trials. These arcana were created by virtuosos -os 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 -os, who imbued their masterpieces with elements refined from chaos. By channeling their magical energies through these arcana, wizards would summon the powerful elements depicted on these works. Hey, cool beans. Let's look at some of these. Info. A lightning element arcana. Earth element arcana. Arcana. Depends on, I guess, how you want to say that. And there's air, and there's fire, and there's water. Oh my god, it's so magical. Mary. It's great that arcana are protected by the magic. They're created with... Yeah, well, that's, that's good, I guess. It means I can take all the flash photos I want. Well... That's good. She's referring to the fact that if you go to uh, traditional museums, you're not really allowed to use flash photography. Um, but yeah, it's because the flash can damage the actual pictures and paintings and whatnot. But that's not what we're here for. We're here for magic. All right. Every arcana was handcrafted by a skilled virtuoso, like the one shown here, which is, I don't know, some person with a bitchin' pomp and some cards. So we... What's this say? Info. Wizards of the time typically favored 
a six arcana hand fashioned to their style. So it sounds like this is almost like a deck building type of a deal. Look at this guy. This guy throwing fire things and stuff. Right, let's see here. Corey. Hey there. Here are a couple of arcana for you to try out. While these replicas won't have any real effects, you can use them in the museum's interactive exhibits. Try giving those training dummies a good one, too. Wind Slash Basic and Dragon Arc. So this guy's using Dragon Arc, but hey, forget him. Let's use Dragon Arc ourselves. Yeah, we summon Fire Dragons. It's pretty bitchin'. And we've also got a little Air Slash thing. Which is pretty cool. Oh, yeah, no, I stood by with bated breath, waiting to hear about the royal wedding. No, I didn't watch Me too. I was in the very back. Did, oh, yes, yes. I could tell. Okay. <laughs> I don't no. ask because it's all over my damn Facebook and I'm tired of seeing it. See, that's why I deleted my Facebook. You know how hard it is to delete a Facebook account? And I'm not hard. saying, I'm not talking about deactivating one. I'm talking about deleting it. I've deactivated it for a good like year and then got a new one, so it's I know, I know I know. It's difficult. Yeah, so I actually went through the trouble of trying to delete my account. You have to actually get in contact with Facebook themselves, send them an email. It's not even like an option in the settings or anything like that. You have to actually send them an electronic mail requesting them delete your account and then then if it's approved that they'll delete it they'll then send you a follow-up email that says okay your 14 day waiting period <laughs> has started to delete your account how bullshit is that See, you wouldn't even you wouldn't even have to delete your facebook if you would only you know been friends with me what what is what does that have to do with anything <laughs> because i'm important and you've been like oh i'm friends with uh little mama on facebook and but we could just why i should keep it but we could just talk like not strangers that want to appear to be friendly because okay, okay, okay. okay, okay, okay. like okay. facebook you're is right. only for people you're that, right that for pretend people to be what? friends and, uh, but true. they aren't actually friends because they're okay. keeping up appearances and if i keep okay. talking with <laughs> stop stop because <laughs> you see little mama we're actually friends we're not faking it Shh, don't tell the internet. All right. <laughs> Diana, welcome to the Signature Arcana exhibit. Try this one out. I will. When fully charged, the exploding fireball Signature Arcana lets you hurl three fireballs in quick succession. Signature Arcana are normally charged by striking targets with spells. But for the purposes of this exhibit, you can pick up the blue magic orb in the practice area. I will do that. Thank you. Look at that. Fucking fireballs. Fireball! Yeah, you can also change the direction of your spells, so you can sit here and just, like, launch it all over the freaking place. Oh, yeah, another cool thing about the uh, Fire Dragon arc thing. So, if you look at the bottom left-hand corner, you'll see a number on top of the actual uh, icon. So, that determines how many dragon heads get launched. So, you can launch all five, and then you can load up, like, one or two, and then you'll only launch, like, two. Depends on what you want to do. But yeah, fun stuff. Let's continue. Alright. Laura! Lara? It's always weird. It's such a British name, the way it's spelled. L-A-R-A. -A. Anyway. <laughs> Lara. Yeah, Lara. Anyway, Lara. That's the girl, that's how she spelled her name. How did she pronounce it? Laura. There you go. Zeal's my favorite. Her style is lit thoroughly on fire. It's, it's, there's a... Eh. Yeah, how she... Anyway. Winston. It appears she was quite the pistol indeed. I feel like I should have given them an accent. Anyway. All right. So, council member. Flame Empress Zeal. She's got fire hair. That's pretty cool. Council member Earth Lord Atlas. Then you got Council Member Frost Queen Freya. It's pretty bitchin'. Fred. <laughs> what a weird name. Anyway, I read somewhere that Freya was the first council member and Atlas joined shortly after meeting her. 
Oh, that's, that's good to know. Harry. Harry, Fred. I, I, I get it. I get it. It's a Harry Potter reference. Anyway, the Chaos Trials were an annual invitational event administered by the Lenovian Council of Magic. These powerful wizards were masters of their chosen elements and fashioned the trials for contestants to undertake. Well, well it's good to know. Thanks. Alright, so these are some of the uh, the baddies, I think. Alright, what do we got here? Sean! Or Seen, depending on how snarky you want to be. This Chaos Army looks pretty strong. Taking on all of them at once would be scary. Yes, it would. Let's talk to the info desk. Genie. Spelled like genie in a bottle, genie. The Chaos Trials featured a variety of formidable foes conjured from Chaos Energy. Some of these conjured enemies would also be imbued with the elements to pose an even greater threat. Oh my. So we got an invisible dude, a chargy dude, and a sword bro. Alright. Yeah, that's cool. Alright, what do we got here? Isaac! Chaos Arcana were specialized Arcana. Crafted directly from Chaos Energies. They require great skill and finesse to activate. Only wizards who successfully completed the Chaos Trials were entrusted with the possession of Chaos Arcana. However, very little is known about the use of these Arcana, as none of these legendary wizards are around today. Well, fancy that. What do we got here? Chaos Gems! I wonder if they're related to the Chaos Emeralds. Were rare crystals that were often used as currency by various artificers of the time. Apparently not. Never mind. Standard metallic coins were also used to trade for goods and services. Hmm, okay, this is good to know. What do we got here? Dawn! Totally would have had tons of gems and coins, but definitely not any Chaos Arcana. Way to go, Stacy. Look at this fucking douche. Who ties a sweater around their shoulders and neck like that and wears sunglasses? Hmm? Hmm? Little mama? Hmm? Hmm? Do what? A douche! <laughs> <laughs> Little mama's over here falling asleep. I am right. not asleep. I was looking at Facebook. I and said fucking royal wedding. I'm I done. said huh? falling asleep. <laughs> I am not asleep. Hi, Jesse. I I need a uh, smoke sausage. Welcome to the Chaos Trials Interactive Course. This course will give you an idea of what it was like to take on the Chaos Trials. Good luck. I know you can do it. Yeah, hell yeah, I can do it. Let's go. Let's go. We got no. Here. I switched strength. phones and it will not let me on my Twitter. I'm. Hmm. Well, what are you gonna do about that? I don't know. I guess not have Twitter anymore. Oh, shit. Ow! Oh, I'm sitting on my feet. Yeah. Yeah, you know, one thing I will say is the uh, the combat in this so far feels really good. The controls are really on point. Feels nice, yo. Like, ah, on shit, point, I they're fell. sharp. Yes. Okay. Yeah. Drop them all off the ledge. All right, let's go. Oh my, we got a big one. to hit circle to dodge. <laughs> what game do I play where I have to hit circle to dodge? Was it Enter the Gungeon? It could have been Enter the Gungeon. Anyway. Oh, sweet. Get a little bit of health back. Alright. David, these snacks are perfect after that exercise. Sometimes I think he, he comes here just for the cookies. Is this a cookie? I know those, those like, round things on the side are supposed to be cookies, but what about, what about the, the health orb thing? I kind of want to recover my, all my health. What are, you, what are you doing up here, Nathan? That course is super tiring. 
but after a few tries, I managed to get the upper hand on that blob. Really? You had some trouble with that, Nathan? It was a fucking blob, my man. Super easy. Alright, what do we got here? Hello. Liam. That's a name I don't see very often. Liam. Didn't know that these wizards ran around with enchanted Neeson? cloaks, too. I, well, yeah, Neeson, obviously, but just, you know, a Liam in the wild? I don't think I've ever met one. In the wild? Have you? No, but just yeah. to say in the wild makes what? me feel like it's a antelope. Well, I've never met an antelope named Liam either. Wizards who entered the Boy. Chaos Trials were usually garbed. That's a fun word, garbed. And a standard garbed. wizarding cloak, as shown here. They were allowed to enter the Trials with one of each of the four classes of Arcana as well as a relic of their choosing. Oh. That's neato. Claire. We finally opened this exhibit, and now I can see why it took so long. So many exquisite pieces. I can't imagine how long it took to collect them all. I don't know, like, five hours? Seems like a good amount of time. Song. Wow, this person's name is Song. I'm so hungry after that interactive course. I'm gonna... I'm going for a sushi dinner course after this. Oh, oh, oh. Can I join you, Song? I love sushi. <laughs> Alright, what do you got here? Info. On display here are some of the relics that were used by wizards in the Chaos Trials. Oh, fancy. Each of these unique relics had powerful attributes that wizards used to great effect in the Trials. Fancy... Ooh, look, cloaks! I love cloaks. Wizarding cloaks used in the tri uh, Chaos Trials were optimized for quick movement and arcana use. Many of these cloaks were even enchanted by skilled tailors to have a variety of potent effects. Well, Mama, if it was socially acceptable to wear a cloak, would you? Yes. Wait. Right. Wait, what do you mean? Yes. What do you, what do you, what do you mean, wait? <laughs> Because if it was a, a cloak of invisibility, it wouldn't matter if it was socially acceptable because you'd be invisible, so... Just... Just a cloak. Just a regular don't, cloak? Don't, 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 okay. Don't think too hard about it. What about capes? Okay, then I'm gonna... Capes... <sighs> I have a hard enough time with the damn vest that I have to wear at work. So, no, I would not wear a cape. This motherfucker is so Harry Potter. The music stopped, I'm concerned. The insignia of legend was a mark of distinction granted only to those wizards who successfully overcame the Chaos Trials. Other than its ceremonial use, not much else is known about this relic, other than that it was crafted directly from Chaos Energy. Fant oh no. Why did I have to read the thing? Vers? Varies? Vers? That fucking wardrobe has a mustache made of handles. Anyway. <laughs> Pardon me, are you all right? That looked like quite a tumble there. Is the fucking mirror talking to me? Whew. Glad to see you're okay. Welcome to your new home away from home. As a wizard invited to participate in the Chaos Trials, your accommodations and our services are provided by the Magic Council. Also included is a one-time stipend of 100 Chaos Gems. You know, okay. Let's be real for a second. If you lived in a country, or nation, or wherever, and one of your main forms of currency were referred to as Chaos Gems? I think there's a problem. Anyway. You'll have to excuse the mess. Bit. We weren't expecting any guests so soon. But not to worry. We'll have everything sorted out shortly. In the meantime, let's do a round of introductions. You can introduce me to the Mr. Wardrobe over here. His name is Ward. Of course it is. Allow me to introduce myself. My name is Ward, and all of your enchanted attire will be in my charge. Now, let's see what fashionable outfits I have ready for you. Okay, I got blue and hope. So hope and patience. Blue or red? What do you think, little mama? You more of a you more of a blood or more of a crip? <laughs> I will, honestly, I'm already wearing red, and I like red. I really do, and I like red nail polish, and, and I wear too much blue because I hate work, so I'd say blue. All right, I'm wearing blue. Okay. What about this? What no, do you think you this? No, you wear too much blue. You are red. Uh, uh, Can you change it? Let's see. 
Yes, I can. Okay, fine. Back okay, to red. red. Okay, uh, I got a chest here. What do you think its name is? Don't say Chester. Don't say Chester. <laughs> Mimi. Oh, okay. No, that's that's good. It's it's Mimi. Hey. Like an actual box, like a chest, that kind of chest. No. The name? I need you to look down. Yes, like a treasure chest. <laughs> well, I'm just wearing joggers and a sports bra, so. My point still stands. Anyway, hey, I'm Mimi, and I'll be snacking on all your relics you find. Maybe I shouldn't say it with that inflection. <laughs> but don't worry, they'll be safe and ready whenever you need them. Oh, sweet. What we got here? Fucking a ring? Friendship bracelet. Increase damage and movement speed when you're with a true friend. I'm assuming that means a, a co-op partner. How about miscellaneous? Museum ticket. Huh. Okay. Ticket to Lenova Museum's newly opened Chaos Trial exhibit. I did go do that. Hmm. Freezing Sprite Anaya. That was the one I was using. Can I equip that? I can. What about the ticket? I can equip the ticket. I don't think there's much point to me equipping the ticket. Let's just go ahead and put that on for now. I don't need the friendship bracelet. But, yeah, okay. What about the book? What do you think the book's name is? Little Mama doesn't know. Alright, let's see. I don't. I was really trying to think of something sarcastic and dumb, but it didn't work. It's Tommy. <laughs> <laughs> A pleasure to meet you. I'm Tommy. And I'll be cataloging all the arcana you come across. Let's peruse your gallery now. It's a fun word. This game has a lot of, of his, fun uh, words. Vermintide. Peruse? No, or, tome. Oh, tomes, yeah. Let's see. Uh, enhanced. Final slash creates a piercing wind that negates projectiles. I don't... Do I have that? I have no idea. Let's see. Airburst dash, yep. Creates a shockwave that buffet foes in your path. That buffet foes? I get to eat them? Alright, Dragon Arc. Summon a torrent of fiery dragons. Fire two dragons simultaneously increases number of charges. That's kind of cool. I'm assuming we can upgrade these things later on. What do we have here? Oh, okay. So do we... Okay, so it looks like we can't change the button placement of these, which is fine. But it looks like we have two choices as far as our circle move. Hmm, frost fan. Throw out a fan of frost daggers that freeze enemies. Enhanced daggers fly further and pierce through enemies. That's good. Rebounding icicles. Conjure a series of icicles that cascade out and return to you. Enhanced icicles travel further. Hmm, interesting. Well, we've already seen the dragon thing, so let's check out this. Oh, basic. I don't have anything else for basic. Signature. Okay, so yeah, I've got two different things for that. Hmm. Kind of digging the fireball. Let's go ahead and keep the fireball, and then we'll use the rebounding icicle over here and see what that's about. Oh, okay. That makes sense. Yeah. I can I can deal with that. Alright, so we talked to everything. Let's talk to Varys. Varys. I don't know how to say that name. I'm just say Varys. Uh, Varys! The Enchanted Looking Glass. Just stomp on by and I'll tell you how stylish you are. Hey, how stylish am I? He's not telling me how stylish I am. It's upsetting. Alright. Can't go down there yet. Guess we gotta go this way. Oh. Nothing in the boxes. Okay. This is a car. Oh! Okay. We're going this way, apparently. Okay. Lenova Plaza. Fuck you, bird. Alright. Ooh. Items. Tozy's Pocket Watch. Super Carrot Cake! Sinister Ledger. Kane. It's my dream to one day live the exciting life of a traveling artisan! Maybe that was the wrong voice for a traveling artisan, but whatever. There's so much to learn about all the different relics found across the land. One important lesson I've learned is that some relics only truly shine when paired with another. It's all about building an effective collection. If you say so. I'm just gonna do the video game things and start hitting stuff to see what happens. Fuck your trees. Alright. Oh, what about you, Lynn? The Nova Plaza is always so lively. Wizards from all around the world come here to train and participate in the Chaos Trials. Alright. My Lind. 
I've par participated in the Chaos Trials for so many years, I've managed to gain some clout with the Council. Perhaps you'd like to visit a particular Council member first in the Trials. A few gems could go a long way. Would you like to begin the Chilling Dungeons? Eh, let's go ahead and skip that for now. What about you? Jade, fine day to be out. I'm looking to purchase some Chaos Gems from aspiring young wizards. I'll pay 200 gold for 20 of your Chaos Gems. Sounds enticing to you? Not today. Jade. Oh, oh, Lenovo Knight. Halt! Only wizards who have been invited to participate in the Chaos Trials are allowed past this point. Oh, you're the last minute entrant. The council has informed us of your arrival. You are free to proceed. Hey, thanks, guy. Alright, I'm not done looking around, though. What do we have here? Wind Flurry. That sounds pretty cool. Grasping Earth also sounds pretty cool. Whirling Tornado. Still pretty cool. Hey, look, it's the person that we saw in the thing. This virtuoso Iris. These fantastic arcana are my latest works. Each one is guaranteed to get you fired up. It's pretty cool. Alright, what about you? What do you have to say? Varric! I attended the Wizarding Academy for a few years when I was younger, but I did terribly. I wish I had studied harder when I had the chance. But I still like to practice using simple arcana when I get the chance. The training helps me clear my mind and is a great exercise, too, if you say so. Hey, Naya, calm down. Freezing shit over here. Oh! There's new freaking... There's new cloaks. Grit. Pace. Vigor. That's just another blue. It's just another blue cloak. You can't lie to me, game. Anyway. Seville! The cloak looks like it could use some quick alterations. What do you say to changing the enchantments to something different? It'll be five gems to alter your outfit. Do we have a deal? Huh. Alter my outfit, huh? Let's take a look. Perfect fit. Even the council would be envious of your new look. Keep in mind these alterations are temporary and will wear off if you change outfits. So what did you do? What did I just... What did I just do for, for that? I don't know. Maybe I have 25 extra health? No clue. Anyway. Do I want to buy a new spell? What do you think, Lamama? Well, think I should buy a new spell? Oh, well, Mama. Oh, Mama. Sorry, I'm in the kitchen cooking. Oh, Mama. Yes, buy a new spell. Okay. Uh, let's see. I'm kind of digging Wind Flurry. It's, it looks like it's like a Wind Spear attack or something. And then Grasping Earth seems kind of cool, too. You know what? I'm going to get Wind Flurry. Whoa. Jesus what does Christ. Grasping Earth do, though? I have no idea. Mm. <laughs> this book just showed up. Tomi, another fine work to add to the gallery. This one looks to be quite the powerful piece. Is it one of these? No. It's not Dash. What about here? Ah, here we go. Unleash a quick salvo of cutting winds. Let's take a look at this. Oh, yeah, that's pretty cool. Yeah, I dig it. Alright, it's like a little machine gun thing. All right, let's see, what do we got here? Grasping Earth and Earth Knuckles Basic. Huh. So, okay. Earth Knuckles is probably a square move. Hmm. Let's get it. All right. What do we have here? Yep. All right, so let's check out Earth Knuckles. Oh, that's pretty cool. I feel like an Earthbender. beat things into submission. I dig it. Alright. That's pretty cool. So, what else have we got here? Whirling Tornado. That costs 75? I do have 75, but what do we have here? Ice Seekers. Okay, that's just pretty That's just pretty cool sounding. What do you think? Ice Seekers or Grasping Earth? What do you, what do you think? I think she's still in it. Uh, Sorry, I'm muting because I don't want to be loud and interrupt your stream by making noises. Oh, okay. It's Ice Seekers I'm making and, chili dogs. and Grasping Earth. Ice Seekers. Ooh, Ice Seekers. Well, Mama has spoken. All right. So, let's see here. What have we got here? It's another one of these. Summon a trio of Seekers that home in on and freeze nearby enemies. Okay. Let's check it out. Oh, Okay. I like those kind of set-it-and-forget-it spells, so... That 
that's pretty neato. What else do we have here? Shearing chain. That sounds pretty cool, but let's check out Grasping Earth, see what that's about. I'm just going to spend all my coins on spells. It's probably a horrible idea, uh, but I like looking at new stuff, so sue me. Designed by Virtuoso Larent Sweert? What kind of a fucking name is that? This arcana allows you to grasp all foes in the area with giant stone fists. Oh, okay. Okay, so it's a radius type of a deal. Let's see here. Okay, that's pretty cool. And we can damage them while they're in the middle of that. That's pretty neato. Alright. Ice Spear Shearing Chain. Alright. Last one. Curious about Shearing Chain. But that's an electricity spell! Alright. <laughs> So far, I'm really liking the aesthetic. All right, so let's check out Shearing Chain. What is this? Oh, that is cool. All right, that is pretty cool. Cooldown's a little, a little crazy, but I'm digging the actual ability. All right, so I'm assuming we can get different you know, dashes. Alright, I know I said that was the last one, but this is an electricity spell. I gotta see what it does. Oh, what is this? Dragon Dive? Dude, that sounds so cool! <laughs> the game? What are you doing? Alright, let's see here. Whoops, didn't mean to blow up your stand. I'm sorry. Oh, that's cool. Alright. Let's see here. I like the residual damage, too. Alright. So I've got an Earth spell and a Lightning spell. It's an interesting choice. I guess we'll just go with this for now. Alright, what do we got? Fenris. I was finally able to meet Frost Queen Freya. But she defeated me in a matter of seconds. Just thinking about her cold laugh since chills down my spine. Cedric, it's great that they allowed you to participate in the Chaos Trials with a friend. Although I can't say I was really useful in our last attempt. It's okay, our teamwork has really been improving. I'm sure we can do even better next time. That's code for you suck now. Alright, let's continue. Start! Looks like we're going through an Earth Trial first, and then Ice, and then Fire. Okay. <coughs> so, I don't know if this layout is random. I guess we'll see. But... For now, let's just continue. Oh, let's see. All right, level one, one. Let's go. All right. Got to be a little bit more careful of damage. Random things that we can collect, maybe? Who knows? I guess we'll just continue. Well, I see in the top left-hand corner, I'm getting a lot of echo right now. How about now? Uh... No? Fun. Yes? No? So I'm assuming that my, uh, like, whenever I see blue damage, I'm doing less damage. So, probably what I'd want to use here is fire and ice, as opposed to, you know, earth and lightning. But, who knows? That's just something we'll have to figure out. Oh, hi. Oh, shit. Didn't mean to do that. Just knock this guy off. Call it good. Oh, mini-boss? 
exit to the stage, perhaps? Hmm. Let's continue back. See what we can find over here. It's a picture. It's a shield. It's dead. Still getting echo. <laughs> I got it turned down. How about now? I don't know what to tell you. Be nice if I could switch up my spells in the middle of the dungeon. Eh, whatever. Let's continue. Am I getting money from breaking shit? I think I'm getting money. I don't know. I've got 67 gold coins. That I... Well, I'm pretty sure I didn't have before. Can I expand the map? No? Oh, yep, yeah, I can. Okay. It's R3. R3 extends the map. So this is where I started, so let's go down south. Ah! Okay. Didn't mean to break all your shit, I'm sorry. Just kidding. Totally broke all your shit. Okay. Enhanced air burst dash. Unfortunately, I don't have enough coin. But I will be back eventually. For the various stuffs. Dodge, dodge! Jesus Christ. Oh my god, not into the pit. Oh, okay. Into the pit again. Into the pit! It's not recommended. Mm. Oh, that was horrible right. performance. Alright. Oh, shit. Oh, no. That was a horrible idea. Okay, let's, just, let's not do that again. Oh, he killed himself. Bitchin'. Okay. Okay, I recovered a little bit of health from that, which is good. It'd be embarrassing if I died in the first stage. Ah, stop comboing me. She happens. The pressure, little lava. The pressure. It's okay. Ah! I can't take it! Oh, you are someone that sells relics. I talk to you? Nox the Unfortunate. Choose wisely, my friend. These relics come at a certain price. Don't let your greed for power become your downfall. So these are like cursed relics, then. Interesting. Sharpened Stylus. Volatile Gemstone. Tortoise Shield. So what will this do? Like, if I choose one of these, will it make it so harder enemies spawn or something? Screw it. I'm taking this. I don't care. You can't stop me. Can I see what my relics do. Yes, L2. Sharpen style at curse. Increase damage, but signature can no longer be charged. That's fine. I don't think I was charging. Wait, what do they mean charged? I don't know. We'll see. I'm probably going to die soon anyway, so it's fine. Ooh, shop. What do we have here? Oh, this one just sells like actual relics. What do we have here? Amulet of Sundering. Sounds kind of cool. Sinister Ledger. Ifrit's Matchstick. Phoenix Talon. Okay. Artisan Andres. The air here is so invigorating. I feel ten years younger. Oh. Okay. Uh, We still have a little bit to explore on the bottom left. I'd end up kicking myself if I didn't look, so let's go look. Continue down this way. Wish I could find Tomy. Switch my stuff up. Hey, bees! Q, Zan's dying soon. Yeah, thanks. I almost walked into that pit. <laughs> that would have been unfortunate. Oh, hello. Hey. Stop summoning shit. Rude. Alright. They are dead. 
Is that it? Is that the whole area? No. I gotta go up and to the right of the starting area. Yep. Alright. I get into a bad encounter, though. That's it! I Done. Like that, I like your little red body. Oh, shit. Thank you. Oops. Screw you, guy. Alright. Got some more slimes. I'm only at 47 health. It's like, not a lot. All right. Oh, so you can swap your spells around. That's good to know. You're dead. It's pretty close to, you know, being... Huh? You know. What? You're pretty close to being... You're pretty close to being dead. Yes. Yes, I am. Very close. And I'm assuming I have to fight a boss still. This is, this is a... It's a dead end. Bad omens notwithstanding. Like, like, can you try to be, like, less dead? Um... Yeah! I could try that. We'll see how that works. Because I thought the wind could, like, blow. What? The wind could blow and just kill you. Yeah, basically. Alright, let's go. Holy shit, he's got a big ass spear thing. Ow. Okay, I've got 12 health left. That's like awesome. It's bad. 12 bad. Bad, 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 bad. Yeah. Alright, we're gonna play keep away. Let's do this. Seven hit combo. I didn't even know. Combos were a thing. Alright, we almost got him. We almost got him. Oh no! Oh, no, nope, I'm good. It only hit me for five damage. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> I'm good. What do we get here? Card. What did they say? Cardus Prime? What's this just do? Oh, it's like a spinning ice thing. That's pretty bitching. Alright, let's continue. Okay, so 100% of the map done. 235 gold, 14 gems. Took me nine minutes. 35 seconds. Alright. Defeated all the enemies, it looks like. Took a bunch of damage, which kind of sucks. Now, do we heal before the next stage? That's the real question. Yes. Uh. <laughs> and nine minutes is a bad wink. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Thanks. Ah, uh, not really <laughs> very much healing. <laughs> Not it's right, only. Are you okay? Are you like, having some trouble over there? <laughs> oh shit! Oh, I got the hiccups. Remember what I said about curing hiccups? <laughs> yeah, you remember. <laughs> yeah, I remember. <laughs> All right. Oh, those yes, are I some do. exploding barrels if I've ever seen. You're them. streaming right now, though. It's true. This is, this is true. So a cure for the hiccups. My have to wait. I have to wait. Yeah, it'd be a little weird if it didn't. Healing between wouldn't be roguelite. I mean, you're right, but I heal a little bit. So that that works. Alright. I'm not dead yet. And I'm, I'm healing a little bit between encounters. I don't know what's triggering it. Oh, we're at the boss already? Damn. I'm not going to fight the boss right now. No? No. I'm gonna try and find some more items. Try and find something. Okay. I'm gonna be very careful. I don't want a fucking slime to kill me. God, that would be embarrassing. Alright. What's this? Firewall? That sounds pretty bitchin'. Heroic leap? What? And seismic entry. <laughs> Ladies! Enhanced air burst dash. What is the enhanced to this though? Create shockwaves that buffet foes in your path. That's pretty cool. Costs a hundred. I can get that and I can get one other thing. 
firewall seems kind of cool. CCing enemies seems kind of nice, if that's what that does. Hmm. Let's go for this. Oh, no. Oh, thank you. Oh, okay, cool. And then firewall, heroic leap. Heroic leap I shouldn't get, because I just got an enhanced air dash. Seismic entry. Is that... That could also be a movement type. So let's go with firewall. Oh, that's an R1. Mm. Yeah, it does exactly what I thought it did. It's pretty cool. Lasts for a little while, too. All right, let's continue. Let's go up. Oh, shit. They're so angry. Oh, nice. My air dash actually does damage now. Didn't get to see how much damage, but it does damage. Oh, that's not bad. I can dig it. I can dig it. Oh, more cursed stuff. <laughs> Jump across that. Oh, shit. So air actually does extra damage to these guys, the little archer dudes. Nice. It's good to know. I'm gonna have to remember some of these element types for what does what. So okay, we can take more stuff. Tiny crocodile heart. Gross. Tortoise shield and double trouble. Hmm. What do you think? Tiny crocodile heart, tortoise shield, or double trouble? Double trouble. Okay. <laughs> We've done it. Now, what do you do? Deal double damage, but receive double damage. Well, my <laughs> what have you done? <laughs> All right, let's do this. He says before dying. Ow! <laughs> like how you go? Well, oh, don't get hit. That's the idea, right? Work this to your advantage. Alright, alright, just don't get hit. It's easy, just don't get hit. Just don't Lil, get Lil hit. Mama has held the key this entire time, guys. Don't get hit. Mm -hmm. Alright. Break all these trees, because you never know what trees are hiding. Alright. Don't need to go that way. No, are we back at the beginning? We are back at the beginning. Okay. Let's continue. Oh, we're locked in. Alright. It's okay, we're dealing with stuff, we're doing things. I'm just gonna get rid of all these explosives that are in the way. Oops. Mess that up. All right, we're not dead yet. <laughs> Somehow. <laughs> All right. Let's just continue on and hope for the best, maybe. Okay. Still not dead. What do we got here? We've got 200 coins. Ooh, a healing potion. Mm, or an item. <laughs> Ooh, I don't know. I think I gotta do the healing potion. Yeah, yeah. do the healing. Yeah, I did the healing. You know better. Yeah. I don't feel good about that, though. I hate buying healing items in a roguelite. It just feels like such a waste. It's like buying hearts in Isaac. It just feels... 
bad. Oh, I almost walked off the edge. Jesus Christ. I'm okay. So we're going straight. Ah, ah, oh, Jesus. <laughs> Nobody pay attention <laughs> to that little move. <laughs> Even though I didn't fall. There's nothing over here, huh? All right. Uh, that's 100% of the map. That is 100% of the map. And that's all the enemies. So let's go to the boss. Boss fight! All I have to do is just keep playing like I've got no health. Alright, let's go. Mm -hmm. This motherfucker's invisible! I don't like it. Firewall! Ow. Fuck you, you invisible motherfuckers. Got him. Okay. Okay. I don't know if double trouble is good or not. <laughs> oh, thank God, healing. All right. 75 healing. Let's continue. Okay. Eight minutes and three seconds. Let's go. All right. Boss fight? Yeah, this looks pretty boss fighty. Do I break this gem? Hey. Do I... Oh, sweet, he healed me. Glad I took a chance on that. <laughs> Alright. So here's the shitty thing. I'm going to be using Earth for my basic attack against an Earth guy. So, not great. No. Earth Lord Atlas, I hope your trip here hasn't been too terrible. <laughs> anyway, because you're about to get crushed. Sorry. Because you're about to get crushed! Oh, no. Right? I mean... No. Why not? Ooh. Ooh. Oh, Jesus, he's earthbending at me. Not cool. Not cool. Not cool, bro! Got him. Oh, yeah. Get comboed to death. <laughs> Earth Lord Atlas, your will is stronger than Diamond. Farewell. A rocky journey awaits you. Okay, you couldn't just not have the Earth puns at the end there. All right, what do we got here? Bunch of gems and Shock Nova. That's pretty cool. What do we got here? Shock Nova. Hold to charge up and release an explosion of electricity that shocks all foes in the area at maximum charge. Can I... Use that. Hmm. Oh. That's pretty cool. That is pretty cool. Alright. We've done it, y'all. Two minutes. Four seconds. The first boss. Dunzo. Alright, so I feel like fire moves are going to be good against the Ice Lady and her various ice cohorts. Co cohorts. <laughs> anyway, let's continue. Level 2-1. Not bad for our first run. Let's see. Just breaking all your fucking ice, lady. Okay. Uh, Dragon Dive. Can't afford it. A little too rich for my blood. Earthen Aegis. That's pretty cool. Lightning Aspect. Fueled Berserk. I can afford. Mm. I can afford a couple of them, but oh, first enemies. Oh, Jesus Christ! They're rushing at me. Ah. All right, so I need time to actually. Ooh, Jesus, charge this. Come on. I keep trying to use my move, and it's it's going to end up getting me killed. I'm going to be real here. Seems like a good opener to an encounter, not necessarily in the middle of it. I don't know. I don't know. Gee, stop it! Stop what you're doing! Okay. Uh, 
Okay. Let's continue. Oh, what do we have here? Phoenix Talon, Rudra's Pinwheel, Sinister Ledger, and Plaguing Sprite Drea. So that's kind of like our Ice Sprite, but maybe it does poison or dot damage? Or I could buy health again! I think I have to buy health. Two times in a row. Feels bad, man. Feels bad. Oh, found the boss. Let's go back. I've only done 47% of the freaking ma Who are you? Krimire the Collector. Allow me to buy your relics. Just drop it on the ground and I'll pay you based on my appraisal. What do we have here? Uh... I could get rid of our sharpened stylus, or I could get rid of our double trouble. Hmm. You know what? I'm just gonna stick with what I've got. Just gonna stick with what I've got. Alright, so let's go this way. Ooh, let's not run off a ledge again. Okay. Let's go explore the rest of this map. This is the beginning. Okay. I'm playing it too safe. You're right. I am playing it safe, but it's my first run. So what do you want, bees? Oh, shit. amount of damage. You're not dead. Now you're dead. Break all those paintings. Screw paintings. What have they done for me? Okay. Just continue on. Run into some more enemy. Yeah, I called it. Freaking called it. Okay. I'm not panicking, you're panicking. Alright. I need to go back. Back to the past. Samurai Jack. Did you ever watch Samurai Jack, little mom? Uh. Um, but I just. I don't know. I wouldn't say I would actually. Nah. Nah. Uh, I'll say no. I'm probably. Out of however many episodes I've made, I've oh, watched shit, like that was a bad three. Choice. Good, good. Ah, oh, explosion! No, L1 attack killed me. No, I'm super dead. <laughs> All right, total time: 24 minutes, 18 seconds. Well, killed three bosses and beat up the main first dude, Earthlord Atlas. Get out of my face, broom. Doing stuff. Anyway. That's going to do it for this first episode. If you guys liked it, feel free to hit that like button, leave a comment down below, so on and so forth. Uh, Lil Mama, say goodbye. Bye. And if you want to see more, uh, stay tuned, because I'm probably going to do more on this. Anyway, I will see you all later. Bye-bye. Uh, if you're watching on stream, feel free to keep watching. going to keep playing.